Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to a new episode of Ark Survival Evolved. So we're starting a new series on Primal Fear. We normally get to six episodes and then quit. Let's try and actually complete the whole series this time. So my plan uh, is to actually defeat Pycon the creator, get the egg and then defeat Pycon's revenge. I do want to defeat all the elementals as well and tame some amazing creatures along the way. That's amazing. We've just got a spyglass. I always sacrifice myself to these guys. They give you crystal. They just spawn in the same location. Get to the corpse of the dodo and you've got crystal early on. That's amazing. Oh, that's so good. Holy crap. Well, that's an easy spyglass. I don't know what magic charcoal is. Man, that's a huge resource amount. I'm getting so much wood. All right, let's start leveling up health. You know, the normal, get everything done. This is my, um, it's a different body from a test character. Okay, um, we need, like, some kind of hatchet or something. Leave me alone! <laughs> oh my god, it's so terrifying when you start on Primal Fear because everything's out to get you. Once we get our, like, reusable spear, you wait. That guy's gonna die. Give me my spear, please! What do you mean I need fiber? Four. All right, that leaves us with quite a lot left. Why don't we go for a possible 400 in health? All right, there we go. All right, we got decent stats, <laughs> holy crap. Let's get a bowler going on. Then we can get a hatchet and stuff and really start the series. So what my plan is for today is to try and get on the alpha tier, but we'd need Quite a lot of crops and stuff like that. Oh, wow. Oh, we have just... We've hit the jackpot. I don't know what else to say. We've just hit the jackpot. Dying's no longer an issue. I think we need to make a small hut, right? A small area right now where we can get a gravestone and a bed going on. And just stay here temporarily. And try and get to that cave area we normally go for. Oh, God! No! 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 I had a bowler! What was I thinking? I'm so dumb! I'm idiotic! I've got no brain! I lack the ability for higher functioning. What the hell? Now we have to get our stuff back from a raptor? Or we get a raptor to attack a bronto. Okay, <laughs> it worked. We barely survived, but it worked. Oh my god, let's get our stuff back. Do not ask how that worked. <laughs> not gonna, not gonna question it. But the raptor was somehow dumb enough to attack the entire Bronto. Oh my god! It's always crazy when you're starting Primal Fear, isn't it? You feel so out of place and so weak, and yet you know you're gonna get so strong. That's what I like about it. It's like one of my favorite mod packs of all time, to be honest. There's nothing like Primal Fear because no matter what you're up against no matter what tier you are you know there's always something stronger until there's not and that's terrifying and that's why i love primal fear okay uh let's go ahead and place down this away from the foundation okay so i did get some skins back i don't know why i'd want those if I'm that lucky, I could potentially get to the cave area. Uh, which would be insane. So why don't I just get myself a gravestone. And then we'll put the rest of the cementing paste in there for safekeeping. And now that I've got a parachute, I'm going to do something really, really stupid. I'm going to teleport directly to the... I think it's the east side of the Redwoods. This 
is stupid. <laughs> We've just set up, but we have a bed over there. Did we place the bed? Yeah, we did. Good. All right, <laughs> just checking. So we're going to be teleporting directly into the, one of the most deadliest biomes in Ark. When we've only got cloth armor, no boots, no, no gauntlets or anything. However, trust me on this. We, we might survive. I might be dead immediately, to be honest. Alright, where are we in terms of... Okay, we're close, guys. We're close to the area I want to be at. We just need to get lucky. That's all we need. Just need to get lucky. That is an alpha Marilla Tops. If we can make it by foot to the cave area, I am the most amazing arc player <laughs> ever in Primal Fear because that takes guts. I'm terrified. <laughs> I keep hearing my own footsteps and I get scared of them. Don't be faster than me. I heard something coming for me and I d I'm hoping it's not faster. No, it's faster! Oh! Oh, thank God. We got so lucky that that was a Pego. If that wasn't a Pega Mastax. Guys, if that wasn't a Pega Mastax. We're close to the area I want to be at. I think this is the main beach area. It might have been the west, you know. It might have been teleporting to the west we needed to go. I successfully made it. This actually is the area. I just got confused. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so it's bound on five. And now, five. All right, so now we're just parachuting down and that right there is the cave base. We actually made it. The only thing we're missing, a bed. We can place the gravestone in there. Demonic, demonic. Demonic. This is terrifying. Okay. Okay. Oh no. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna hide. I've got no stamina, no food, no hunger. I'm gonna. Am I gonna die? Oh, let me survive, please. Let me just place the gravestone down. If I can place the gravestone down, I can grab the stuff. And no matter, like, if I die, I can just try and continue to get to this area because I'll still have the stuff. Oh, man, that is just terrifying. Do we have enough for a bed? I don't know if we do. Oh, my God. <gasps> Guys, if we die now. Food. Food. Berries. Berries. Okay. Um, um, no way. How much HP are we on? We survived with 30 HP, but we made it to the cave base. <laughs> Holy crap. All right, why don't we transfer to the other base and um, get all our stuff. Transfer. Oh my God. I cannot believe that. We set a base location there. Yeah, we just need a little bit more hide and then we've got an awesome spyglass. So that already is phenomenal. I forgot about these. These might actually help us survive right now. Until we get meat. I mean, we had meat, but then, you know, that Pego stole it. If it hadn't have been a Pego Mastax, if it was anything else other than a Pega Mastax, right now we would not be in this base. I'm not sure what I want to start with. All I know is I definitely want to start with getting myself an awesome spyglass because, God, just the vanilla. Oh no. That monkey over there is terrifying. I wonder if it's one of the ones that can. <laughs> wow, you came out of nowhere. Alright guys, welcome back. It's been a few minutes. I decided to spawn at this base because I don't want my stuff to despawn in the other one. Oh, wow. Ha. Huh. Yeah, how about we go back? <laughs> 
Ferrazinosaur right there on the beach. That is not normal. Alright, there we go. Both beds respawn. So, uh, why don't we go ahead and pick this up this time and learn our lesson. Well, learn my lesson, because I'm an idiot. And I never picked up the bed. Alright, so we know there is an alpha down there. I also turned my microphone down a bit. Um, again, you know, new series. Trying to figure out all the settings and stuff. You know, never really going to get it right. The first time X to prone. Alright, I have no idea where we can find any dino with hide. Mm. Scratch that. Yo. Let's guess hide found us. Damn. Hide found us. We got our spyglass. We have got the most luckiest start ever. Like, I I don't get how we're this lucky. We cannot be this lucky. We spawn on a beach, does a trailer bite. We instantly get a gravestone. We look for hide, hide finds us. Explain that. Explain in what reality we are ever that lucky. Obviously, we're not going to live on a thatch foundation. Maybe we had some, like, stone foundations up here. Mine this stone out the way. So, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to build the base. And I'm going to come back to you guys. See you guys in a bit. Hey, guys, and welcome back. So, <laughs> there is a buffoon Methopithecus that killed me. It's currently outside, and I'm kind of scared that it's going to come in. But, um, take a look at the base so far. We got some pretty good stuff coming on, you know? We got two beds, uh, mortar and pestle, you know, just the basic stuff. I am about to get metal tools, because we're going to need a little bit more crystal for the actual primal smithy. And keep in mind, that's the stuff we make all the modded stuff in. So, if we can get one of those, that would be amazing. We can actually get both metal tools. I did not think I had enough hide for that. So, we have a, um, a refining forge already getting us a ton of stuff. We... So terrifying. I'm hoping we have enough, but we don't have enough for a grappling hook. Okay, so we are going to have to take the long route up. Wow. That is a celestial power attack. The celestials around? Holy crap, I was not expecting that. Okay, I don't know if anything's chasing me. I hope not. No, it's not. Good. All right, keep in mind there are alpha for jaw hawks now, so they can swoop down and insta kill you, and I hate that. The only crystal node is guarded by a manticore. Of course it is. Of course it is. You, you no know, way, it's up this way. Oh my god, that would have been terrifying. All right, crystal, found it. That must mean that the Noggling King's behind us. Right in front of it? Yeah, there he is. Alright. Manticore, man. Seriously. Alright. There's the Noggling King. We can go ahead and find the very first runestone. So many more of them to come. Alright. Let's go ahead and mine all the metal we can get so far. Get started. <clears throat> Yeah, there's a manticore. We're definitely going to die here. I just want all the crystal, you know? I don't want to... Oh, don't do it. Don't do it! Come on! Come on, man! I just... I just want the crystal. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There's a manticore for you. Yes! Both the raptor and him? Results! And we can fight our first Toxic as well? Oh. The progress on this episode, man. We are so lucky. Okay, no loot, but there's so many of them around. Seriously, though, I don't know what the progress problem is in this episode. We're just dominating. We get some of these Dodos tamed as well. We can start getting to the Toxic here. We could get Dillos. Plenty of Dillos around, male and female. 
Only require a bit of meat. Plus we have those arrows that we got from loot. We got one. We needed two. Wait. I think we can actually get another one. I think we actually can. Yeah. Alright. So if we can get a bow. Can we get one? Hey, we can get him. We can get him. Do that. Move to the side. Oh. He calculated it that time. Alright. He's down. Let's go ahead and give him some meat. Alright. He's going to tame. Pretty quickly because he's a dillo. You. 1.6k. I don't know. I'm hoping. Alright, let's try and get a headshot on you. If we can. Fired. Okay, right. 1.6k. Come on. Come on. It's not going to do it, is it? Come on. Come on, please. Come on. Come on, please. Please. Please do it. Oh, you absolute ass. Alright, don't we have those, like... Spears in Primal Fear. I think it's like you use eight narco arrows and you can get like a temporary like primal spear that sucks or something. Right, see if I can jab you in the butt with this poison spear. There we go. Yeah, they, they break easily, but they're not bad, you know. Especially for early game. Right, how much do you need? You need six. Six, okay. So we'll track you two. See if we can. Oh, for your hawk. I'm not tame enough for your hawk. The hell's that coming up for? We could go after the Tyrannodon. We do still have that spear. I, I don't know if we'll be able to get a Tyrannodon with a spear. Like, it's definitely probably going to break, but I'd hate to waste it just sitting in our inventory. It's going to break. Alright, sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. Someone came in my room and interrupted the recording, but we did actually manage to knock it out. And the Dilophiosaurus is done. Not bad. So this guy is actually going to take 36 raw meat. Okay. I tell you what, that spear is not bad, you know. I'm not going to lie, that spear is really not bad. We definitely need to wait for her. We definitely do not need to wait for the Tyrannodon. Like, I think I'm just going to get tame helpers. Um, I do want to get a um, elder so that we can get a load of rare mushrooms as well. But we probably need a Tyrannodon for that, you know, to fly to the area. I don't think there's any way we can get tame helpers without looting things. So we think we might have to go on a big looting run to try and find Taven helpers to get a flyer to start with. Then we can get an Elder Mosjops. Use that to get tons of rare flowers and rare mushrooms. And then we can also use that to get tons of seeds as well. Um, ideally we tame a Iguanodon because I, I normally use the Iguanodon to just seed all the uh, stuff in its inventory for the narcotics and stuff. But for now, why don't I do a bit of a time lapse and we'll uh, wait for her to tame. We are back. <clears throat> okay, so it tamed. Um, I don't know what's going on with the uh, tab menu, but yeah, it tamed. It, I was just like watching a podcast on YouTube in the background, but it finally tamed. It took so long. I don't know about the um, the Tyrannodon. Oh, yeah. I think we're just gonna leave the Tyrannodon. I mean, I don't want to, but. GET OUT OF TOWN! ARE YOU KIDDING ME? OH, YOU HAVE GOT TO BE KIDDING ME! 
<laughs> Why? We had good news is so inside my own head that was freaky. Right, the good news is that thing 100% gonna despawn. So, does that? Let's go ahead and repair our uh, stuff. Don't know if I want to start the mating just yet because, like, if you know, that thing's over really for your hawk. It's waiting for me to die, huh? Hey, hey, that's it, that's it, that's it. Look at me, I'm a juicy human. Juicy human! Yeah, I reckon... It might take us about two bowlers, but we can do it. Loot? No. Of course there's no goddamn loot. Of course. <sighs> God damn it. We just need one tame helper. Yeah. Gotcha. Loot, yes. I can't take it anymore. I just wanna die. Are you for real? I hate Fjorhawks. They suck. They genuinely suck. They made modified variants. Really, what we need to do is just start the game. I feel like I've been so preoccupied on trying to get tame helpers that I'm just waiting for something to happen. Like, I, f I feel like we just, we just have to get into it. There's no tame helpers. We just get straight to the point and tame what we need. So, if I can get myself some large crop plots... Um, ideally, we build it out there, but that's never going to happen. That's never going to happen. All right, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right. Um, one, two, three, four. Five. All right, guys, that pretty much does it for an episode, unfortunately. But thank you all so much for watching. We got so much done today. We got these amazing Dilophiosauruses that we definitely need to name in the next episode. We have the Primal Smithy online. I did want to get to the Alpha Tier today, but man, time just flies when you're having fun. So I will see you guys in the next episode when we have like all the crops online and everything and then maybe we can start taming some modified dinos. But hey, Dilophiosauruses moving into a cave base, a ton of resources. I think we did absolutely amazing. See you guys in the next episode.